Philippians chapter 2, verses 5 through 11. In your relationships with one another, have the same mindset as Christ Jesus, who, being in the very nature of God, did not consider equality with God something to be used to his own advantage. Rather, he made himself nothing by taking the very nature of a servant, being made in human likeness. And being found in appearance as a man, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to death, even death on a cross. Therefore, God exalted him to the highest place and gave him the name that is above every name, that at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue acknowledge that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Here's the formula of what the world teaches us about relationships. Number one, utilize people to get where you want to be. People and relationships are pawns for your success. It doesn't matter where they are, it's only about you and where you need to be. Number two, if you consider yourself a nothing, you may need counseling. Number three, serving someone is humiliating. Number four, humbleness is considered a weakness. Number five, and if we do everything that we can to avoid death, tr trying to stay young, uh, being alive, we may dye our hair or even get plastic surgeries, we don't want to be dead. So when we go to this text, and according to Paul, Christ exhibited the opposite traits of what we consider important. His advice suggests that true strength comes from hope, humbleness and servanthood. And we have the proof that the name of Jesus has been the most recognized, polarized, talked about person of all time, whether you believe or not that he is the son of God. But I give you a warning that we should not use this text that comes from Paul, this Philippians chapter two, verses five through 11, in order to make a name for your, yourself, to take on a form of piety so that we can be noticed, but rather what we should do is to celebrate Christ, to celebrate his way, celebrate his path that leads to discipleship and glorifying almighty God. Praise the name of Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior, who's shown us the way, shown us on how to live and drawn closer to God. Amen.